This is the comparison between the Vox Delay Lab and the Korg SDD3000. And uh, these pedals look very similar. Uh, they're exact in size, uh, just different knob layout, and uh, they're from the same company. Uh, Korg owns Vox. And uh, let's hear how they uh, sound uh, comparing to each other. Um, I popped the back of the pedals off, and you could see uh, the uh, circuit boards are a little different, just a slightly different layout. So um, basically, they're using the same uh, uh, shell, but uh, it's coated in black, and uh, it's got different layout. So um, uh, I'm playing on a Fender Stratocaster into a Vox AC30. Here's a clean signal. All right, so let's start with the uh, digital setting on the uh, delay lab, and then we'll go over to the SDD3000, which is in a true bypass looper uh, because of its uh, preamp that you cannot um, bypass. It, uh, it's always on. So here's the delay lab, and then we'll go to the SDD3000. <laughs> Korg SDD. Um, I have the tone all the way up on the Vox and the Korg. We have no filtering engaged. And you can hear the SCD is kind of a little bit duller. The repeats are a little warmer, as you can put it. And um, But uh, we can basically roll down the tone knob here and kind of match it. Kind of gives gives a little bit life to the signal and a little drive, just um, kind of excites it. Uh, all right, so that's the digital, and we can also um, there's added filtering. We can uh, cut the highs. <laughs> Or we can cut the lows.
lows and the highs a little bit. We also have modulation. sound really close it's just that preamp on the SDD let's turn down the um, balance and let's use the preamp to push the delay lap It's not quite the same when you push the uh, the delay lab with the SDD's preamp. It just doesn't sound as as good, even though you turn down the highs and tweak with the tone. So that's how they compare. Uh, check out the other comparisons of the other sounds. And thank you for watching. <laughs>